it's a weird place for me to be is Nashville. It's a very intimidating place to play and to to be a musician because everyone is so good. And you can just go downtown, just go down on Broadway um, and these guys are playing there for free every night for hours on end. I ain't even heard of any of them but I mean they're, they're all incredible and there's one young guy, uh, Daniel Donato, who plays at Roberts who is like 17 or 18 and he's he's incredible he's the sort of guitarist I see and it, it makes me want to give up because I just think you know I was playing with Lego when I was his age and, and he's on stage tearing it up and being incredible but you know I, I guess I can't look at it like that I've got to think that it makes me want to try harder um, it, but still it's very intimidating everyone's a singer everyone's a bass player, everyone's a guitarist, you know, everyone seems to have their own thing going on. This is Sputnik. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, a collection of x-rays, and I love little stuffed toys, I love all these little teddy bears. I kind of, you know, like to imagine, you know, how much they've all been played with. Um, and then we have the taxidermy, and we've got a headless children on the steps. I don't find it creepy at all. I, I find it, you know, it's just interesting. I'd rather live in a in this little my weird surroundings than live in a, a beige, you know, boring box. There's lots of similarities between Britain and, and America, and there's there's, there's a lot of um, a lot of separation as well. I mean, in England, if you wanted to be in a band, um, you wanted to pursue music, or you want to pursue any art, you know, whether you wanted to be a a, a painter, or a dancer, or a photographer, or a filmmaker, it was kind of it's well, it's even still, I suppose, it's looked down upon. It's regarded as a hobby. The one thing I love about America and, and Nashville especially is that it's it's a legitimate career path here. You know, because it's maybe um, accepted a bit more. Um, it it seems the, the ed, there's not as much edge to it. A lot of the bands that are so-called, you know, they call themselves punk. It's that's really not punk. You know, um, punk was punk was a a time, you know, there was a time in England when we were going through a lot of shit. You know, kids didn't have a voice and, you know, the youth didn't have a voice and they expressed themselves through music and it was very, it, it meant a lot more than just the music itself. Um, and then if you, if you compare that to the American punk scene, I mean, it's nothing like that and it, they've really kind of missed the point. So yeah, America has a lot more encouragement for people to be in bands and to follow their dreams, but the, there seems to be something a little missing. Hopefully I'm kind of meeting it somewhere in the middle.